Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen Wa salatu wa salamu ala nabiyyina Muhammadin Wa ala alihi wa ashabihi wa azwajihi ajma'in Amma ba'd fa a'udhu billahi minash shaitan rajim Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Rabbish rahli sadri Wa yassir li amri Wa ahlul uqtatam min lisani yafqa'u qawli Rabbi zidni ilman ajma'in insha'Allah May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increase in all of us knowledge Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Brothers and sisters, we are on the final phase of learning the three letter verb. Next three let lessons are extremely important with a lot of heavy doses of Arabic terminology. But I think you are now strong enough to understand and even to appreciate and enjoy it, inshallah, brothers and sisters. We have studied this in the past, in uh, book one, but at that time you were very new, so uh, uh, you may not have comprehended everything. But today, inshallah, you'll comprehend everything. Uh, brothers and sisters, every verb in Arabic language, you can trace it back to three letters. Every verb. Okay? 99 point nine percent previously I said 99.5 but I think you can make it 99.9 they are all three letter verbs huh? you can trace it back take any verb you can trace it back to three letters which is the root and what is the root of it the fa'ala huh? fa'ala is the root remember? that's the pattern huh? Sh shall I write it down or you, you know it huh? fa'ala but I think I should write it down huh? I will write it down brother you know, because somebody who is watching the video, maybe will get it better, inshallah. Brothers and sisters, 0.01% is the four-letter verbs. What are they? Four-letter verbs. I mean, the root has four letters. And the most common example, we can say, Tarajama. Huh? Tarajama. He translated. That's four letters. Huh? And then we have... Was wasa. That is four letters. Then we have zalzala. That is four letters. Huh? 
and then we have ba sara these are four letters but they are very few otherwise 99.9 percent may allah forgive me if i make an error 99.9 percent is three letter words but it's fa ala and then we knew from our study that fa kalima has always a fata lam kalima has a fata permanently permanently and ain kalima can have a fata dam of kasra it can have and when they go into mudariya also the fa kalima gets a sukun ha yaz and then abu lam kalima gets a damma this is in the base form ha huh? in the first form and then ain kalima can have anything and that is why we have six bobs remember that is the reason we have six bobs because we don't know what will be the position of ain kalima those who speak arabic i always say it is in their blood huh? remember i said when the child has the first drop of milk from his or her mother the whole arabic language is passed on to the child you know for us we have to make a special effort to learn it they have it in their blood but inshallah it will go into our blood also inshallah huh? so brothers and sisters fa ala okay fa kalima ain kalima lam kalima are you with me brothers and sisters now uh, what happens here when we try to conjugate huh? what happens brothers and sisters we know our pronouns huwa huma hum hiya huma hunna anta we know 14 pronouns they are divided into two groups hmm? what i'm saying now i'm repeating because we did it but it must have escaped your mind now huh? Huh? because it's very common to have hawa mein udta jaye are you with me brother hawa mein udta jaye mera fail or file ho ji ho ji okay idhar udhar lehraye mera mudaf aur mudaf ilahi okay brothers and sisters we have here the red or file fiel must have a file they have a special relationship okay in arabic the fiel is always with file okay so file in the verb or the ma'ir what are they file in the verbs are pronouns okay huh? it is all pronoun see that's why we have huwa huma hum where is the file here mustatir huh? and where is the file here in the here mustatir huh? brothers and sisters i'll put a circle here okay now where is the file here alif you know it huh where is the file here wow where is the file here ta what is on them what is on them sukun they have a sukun on it huh, brothers and sisters the scholars of arabic grammar have combined these five now remember huwa and he eh? brothers and sisters the file can be maujood in the sentence or it can be mustatir if it is mustatir then it is dhamir otherwise the file can be a noun proper noun huh? because zahaba muhammadun so muhammadun is the file aina muhammadun then you will say zahaba now the file is dhamir huwa huh? okay fine now these are called sakin dhamir and they are sakin pronouns are you with me this alif represents huma waw represents hum are you with me they represent huh? and they are sakin sakin pronouns are you with me and then we have starting from hunna and when we were learning i made up a story that we want to invite hunna to join verb and she said you have to sign an agreement and i said we have to send the agreement to the lawyer and the agreement came back and then we signed it i made that story to make it a little more interesting but here brothers and sisters today we learn why is it that the lam kalima gets a sukun here zahaba zahaba there is on 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 lam kalima 
دي زي يعني حركات دي زي حركات what happens there it gets a sukun why why does it get a sukun there because the pronoun that is a fa'il is mutaharrik sakin and mutaharrik means it has got a proper vowel sign on it that is the difference so whenever there is a fa'il in the verb which is a damir if it has got a harakat then the lam kalima will have a sukun are you with me so you now today you will remember this sakin pronouns and mutharrik pronouns this you must understand today and also memorize it sakin pronouns and mutharrik pronouns huh? brother how many sakin pronouns in madi five how many mutharrik pronouns in nine we have to remember and whenever mutharrik pronoun will come as a file brother and sisters the lam kalima should get a sukun that's the rule and brother and sisters so that is why you can see starting from hunna it is zahab 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 here it is zahaba zahaba zahabu are you with me this thing is very very important to remember huh? the gist of all this is that if the file which is a damir if it is a sakin okay then the lam kalima gets a proper vowel huh? if the file which is a damir is a mutaharrik then the lam kalima will get a sukun because in the next verbs this is what will happen as soon as you have a mutaharrik pronoun the verb will behave differently verb will behave different so dr abdul rahim for the first time mentions in this lesson mutaharrik pronouns so if you were to read on your own you will say what is this mutaharrik Uh, it is very simple mutaharrik pronoun means that the damir which came comes as a fa'il has got a proper vowel sign on it uh, can you see zahab na zahab ta do you see uh, ta tuma tum ti tuma tunna tu na they got proper harakat compared to here zahaba sukun zahabu sukun got the idea please keep that in mind now we are doing today ajwaf if there is a vowel or ya in anywhere in the verb then the, we call the verb is weak huh? ya or vowel anywhere anywhere whether it is fa kalima ain kalima lam kalima if it is there then it is weak so we studied before fa kalima weak what do we call that verb misal huh? wajada so fa kalima is weak wajada now we come to the ain kalima when the ain kalima is weak what happens okay here are some of the things that i will write down brothers and sisters <clears throat> kala and then i will say ba a and then i will write down na ma okay brothers and sisters kala is ka wa la ba a is ba ya a and na ma is navi ma are you with me brothers and sisters so ajwaf means hollow ha huh? fa is sound lam kalima is sound first radical and third radical have sound letters you know and then ain kalima can have ya 
or wow. But we don't see it because that wow or ya has changed into alif. Are you with me? It has changed into alif. So, kala is kawala, but how do I know? We have to go to mudharya. When you go to mudharya, ain kalima becomes visible. When we go to mudharya, the ain kalima becomes visible. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters? So, kala becomes yakulu. Huh? Kala becomes yakulu. Okay? I will write down, brother. Ya ku lu. Ba becomes ya bi u. And nama becomes ya na mu. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Okay? Now, the thing is, originally, it uh, yakulu, kawala yakulu is bab nasara. Nasara. Yan suru. So it should have been, should have been uh, yak wulu. It should have been. But it is not. Because that's the way the changes come in the verb. Because these are weak verbs. So yak wulu became yakulu. It's all there in the key, inshallah, you'll read it. Baya, now this is bab daraba. Daraba yadribu. Baya should have been Yab Yiu. It should have been Yab Yiu. But it is not. It became Yabiu. This signs, vowel signs got changed, you know. Okay. Now, uh, maybe I should quickly erase this, brother. Then I can write down here. Uh, Originally, it was yak wulu, huh? and this was yab ji u. See, now we are going in detail, and this is navima became yan va mu. Now yan va mu change into yanam. Huh? Huh? This is. The change, these are the changes that take place, huh, brothers and sisters. So keep that in mind. Huh? There are only three forms in Ajwaf. Okay, brothers and sisters. Now, what happens? You start from Ka'ala. Start conjugating Ka'ala. 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 Ka'lu. Ka'alat. Kalata and then why kulna, brother? Uh, the reason is I give you the in-depth reason. The reason is, sister Manas, that at kulna the file is mutaharik. Are you with me? <laughs> what is the file at hunna? Mutaharik. So whenever mutaharik joined, further changes took place. One change was that the Lam Kalima gets a Sukun. The other change was in this Ajwaf that the Fa Kalima got a Dhamma. When did it happen? With the Muhammad? Mutaharik pronouns. Now you will say Mutaharik pronouns. Eh? Sakin pronouns, normal. Kala, Kala, Kalu, Kalat, Kalata. Mutaharik pronouns. Kulna. When did the change take place? Mutaharik pronouns. I want you to memorize this. Mutaharik and Sakin. Okay, brothers and sisters. So, further change took place, brothers and sisters, that here is a Kala. Okay, brothers and sisters. Here comes our Mutaharik pronoun. Okay, brothers and sisters. There is a vowel sign here. There is a vowel sign here. Now, as soon as mutaharik pronoun came, it got a sukun. But what is on alif? Also sukun. We cannot have two sukun. This is called iltikai sakinaini. 
What is the meaning of iltaka? To meeting of them. Not possible. Huh? So, then if there is a meeting of uh, two letters, two sakin, okay, and if one letter happens to be a weak letter, vow or ya, you drop it. But what happens when the both letters are sound? What happens? You can't drop it, brother. Then we got to put our surgeon's gown and we'll do a little more surgery. Huh? That will come in lesson number 29. And, and then how do you describe it in, in grammar? Huh? It's so beautiful, brother. You will love it, inshallah. Huh? Here, we just dropped it. So what became now? Kulna. Okay. Fa kalima get dhamma. When it is bab, when it is bab, nasara. Otherwise, it will get a kasra. When did it happen? When the mutaharik pronoun came. That is the key. We never used these things before. Now we have to know that it is the mutaharik pronoun. When mutaharik pronoun came, the change took place even on fakalima. And once you know kulna, where are you now, brothers and sisters? You are on 407. Huh? Then you can just, you know, put the car in the top gear. And what will you say? Kulna, kulta, kultuma, kultum, kulti, kultuma, kultuna, kul, kultu, kulna. What are, you, what are we doing? Ta tumatum, ti tumatunna, tuna. So, so easy, so beautiful, brother. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fine. Now, Mudariya is yakulu. Huh? Yakulu. Fine. Let's conjugate. Yakulu. Yakulani. Yakuluna. Takulu. Takulani. Why yakulna, brother? Motaharik pronoun. Mashallah. Mashallah. Excellent, brother Abdul Mukim. Motaharik pronoun came. Huh? See, we didn't do this way before. Now, we are now. We are strong now. We can handle it now. So, brothers and sisters, Yakulna. And then, Anta, Takulu, Takulani, Takuluna, Takulina, Takulani. Why Takulna? No, the pronoun came. Eh? Akulu, Nakulu. Huh? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now, let us think now. Huh? How many mutaharik pronouns in Mahdi? Nine. How many mutaharik pronouns in Mudarya? Oh. Those are Mabni. But they are mutaharik. So we are now going at once. How many mutaharik pronouns in Mudarya? Two. What are they? Hunna and Antunna, that's all. You must remember it. Huh? You will not forget this. Huh? Those are the only two mutaharik pronouns in Mudarya. Okay, now I change it. How many sakin pronouns in Madi? Five. How many sakin pronouns in Mudarya? Twelve. Huh? Huh? We know our mathematics. <laughs> okay, keep that in mind. It will help us to do and understand fail very well. Okay, well, now we come to Ba, I don't know what is inside Alif. It has to be Wow or Ya. So we go to Mudarya. And what happens? Ba, Ya, Bi, U. I see Ya there. Okay. That is the Ain Kalima. So now I can say Ba, the root is Baya. Kala, the root is Kavala. Ba'a, the root is Baya'a. Baya'a. And that is Bab Daraba. Daraba Yadribu. Baya'a Yabhi'u. Change into Yabhi'u. Fine, brother and sister. Start conjugating. Ba'a, Ba'a, Ba'u, Ba'at, Ba'ata. And then, why Biyana? Mutaharik pronouns came. Huh? Mutaharik pronoun came. Huh? 
Uh, okay, not only it gave sukoon to the lam kalima, but it made a changes on fa kalima also. Uh, that because it's a weak letter. Uh, these changes take place only in weak letters, not in normal letters. Uh, so, if it is not bab nasara, then it will get a kasra. And once you know biena, and then biata, biatuma, biatum, biati, biatuma, biatunna, biatu, biena. Easy, brother. Tell me, is it, is it not halwa puri? Inshallah, you will find it as a halwa puri. Inshallah. I found it very delicious. These verbs are very delicious, brother. Now, nama. Here there is a trick. Nama. Huh? And then it is yanamu. I am lost. What is it? On ayn kalima. I am lost. Nama. Yanam. I don't get a cue that I got in the other two. Huh? But then we got to go to dictionary and we will be told that it is Nama is actually Navima. Huh? The Ain Kalima is Wow. When do I get to know that? When I go to the Master. What is the Master of Nama? Naumun. See? Huh? Naumun. La ta khuduhu sinatun wa la Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So see, Quran is the guide for all these things to us. Nauma. What is Nauma? Master. What is the root? Navima. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So when it is a Bab Samia, Navima is Bab Samia, it becomes Yanamu. I don't see the vow. Okay? I will see the vow in master. Same thing, brothers and sisters. Khafa yakhafu. Are you with me? Khafa yakhafu. I don't see the uh, Ain Kalima in Mudarya. Where will I see it? Master. What is the master of Khafa? Khawfun. Vow came out. Huh? So this also we will keep it in our mind. So it's very easy, brothers and sisters. Extremely easy. And since you are very strong uh, in, uh, in the Mudharia, five, uh, three groups, remember? Uh, five in your pocket, and then Nun Nata hai, Nun Jata hai, and then the Mabni form. So, inshallah, you will find it very easy. Now the problem starts here again. Kala Yakulu. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now, if I want to make this into Sakin, uh, Majzum, uh, Sister Afza, I want to make Yakulu into Mazum because Lam has come. As soon as I put Sukun, there are two Sakins. Iltikai Sakinaini. Iltikai Sakinaini. Okay? I cannot have. But then I see one of them as a weak letter. So I have got my knife ready. To chop it off. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So what will become? Yakul. Yakul. Dr. Abdurrahim has done all these exercises so beautifully, brother. So very, very beautifully. That inshallah you will enjoy it. Now the thing is this, brothers and sisters. Every verb mentioned, you should conjugate. Try to conjugate. At home. Sheets are there. Uh, do... At least five from Bab Nasara, five from Bab Daraba, and two from Bab Samia. Eh? At least, eh? at least, more better for you. Okay, brothers and sisters, uh, I want to go to the key now. Eh? Open the key, brother. Page 91, brothers and sisters. What do you see? Kala Yakulu. You see AU. What is AU? Bab Nasara. Okay. So these are the verbs, you know. If you want, you can put into bracket. Okay. And say Bab Nasara. You know, make a big bracket, brothers and sisters, up to 91. Up to Bala Yabulu. But you can ignore Bala Yabulu. We are not interested. We are not interested. Eh? Okay, brothers and sisters. 
So these are all Babnasara. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? Starting from Kala Yakulu up to Bala Yabulu. And what is after that? Jaa Yajiu Baa Yabiu. What are these, brother? Babdara. Huh? A Shayaishu Kala Yakilu. Okay. AI is Bab Daraba. Put into, you know, with a pencil or bracket, inshallah. And brother, then we have four in Bab Samia. Nama Yanamu, Khafa Yakhafu, and Kada Yakadu. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fine. Okay. So this is the details of the verbs that we are studying and inshallah you will try to conjugate brothers and sisters if you will conjugate you will become expert huh? inshallah you will all become experts in Arabic verbs even though we may not speak the language fluently our concern is Quran and whenever you will come across a verb in the Quran what will happen brothers and sisters you will know how the verb was constructed. What is the root of it? You will know everything. And it will give you immense pleasure, inshallah, when you will understand the Quran, inshallah. Remember, I told you, brother, once you will complete this course, it will change your life. Why? Because now you are understanding Quran the way you never understood before. Uh, inshallah. Okay, brothers and sisters, I come quickly to, I'm not doing the main lesson yet. Huh? I'm coming to the exercises. Uh, exercise number two. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Exercise number two. Hadihi amsilatun lil fil al mu'tal al ain. Uh, the week of Ain. Ain, brother, sister. Kala Yakulu. Kana Yakulu, another very important word. Let us do it, brother. Kana Yakunu. So we have we know what will happen at Mutaharik pronouns. Uh, kana, Kana, Kanu, Kanat, Kanata, Kunna. And after that? Kunta, kuntuma, kuntum, kunti, kuntuma, kuntuna, kuntu, kunna. Huh? Then yakunu, yakunani, yakununa, takunu, takunani, yakunna. Huh? Motaharic pronoun. Then takunu, takunani, takununa, takunina, takunani, takunna, akunu, nakunu. Huh? Let us take the five in our pocket. Yakunu. Takunu, takunu, akunu, nakunu. Make them majzum. Yakun, yakun. Huh? We are making majzum. We are not making amar. Yakun, takun, takun, akun, nakun. Huh? It's very easy, brother. Are you with me? So these are the verbs. Then the comes next verb uh, is jaa. Yajiu. Okay, what are they? They are Bab Daraba. Huh? Jaa, Yajiu. So what is the root of Jaa? Jaya. What is it? Ja, Ya, and Hamza. Okay. Now, I must also, uh, at this stage, must tell you that if in Ajwaf, the Ain Kalima uh, is Vav, we call it Ajwaf. Vavi. What will you call it? Ajo Vavi. If the, it is Ya Kalima, which is in the center, what will you call? Ajaf Yai. The same will be Misal Vavi, Misal Yai. And the same will be Nakas Vavi, Nakas Yai. So you will know it, huh, inshallah. Okay. Then, whether we have the third, first was A, uh, then Ba, and now Jim, Nama Yanamu, Khafa Yakhafu. Kada yakadu. You know, kada yakadu is a weak verb. Almost. 
he did something, but almost he didn't do it, but he was about to do it. Zala yazalu. Huh? Zala yazalu. To seize. And normally, Zala yazalu will come with la yazalu. Mean it is continued. Okay? Will you keep that in mind, brothers and sisters? Now we come to we come to Amar, inshallah. Where you have to be very careful because we can make a mistake. But we have to go on our own. That is why you have the sheet. When you have the sheet, you should do it and see how the Amar comes. What will be the Amar of Ala? Kul. Huh? But what will be for Huma? Kula. How will you write down Kula? With wow. Huh? The wow doesn't get dropped. It got dropped only in the first. This is where most of us make mistakes. Huh? We say Kul and then we round Kula without wow. Are you with me? I will write it down. Kul and then Kula. Why Kula, brother? It is Yakulani. Yakulani. If I make Amar, I drop this. Okay, brothers and sisters, I drop this. What is left? Kula. See, wow. But do not say Kula with, without wow. That will be wrong. So, Kul, Kula, Kulu, Kuli, Kula, and then Kulna. Huh? It's very easy, brother. It's easy. Huh? That's why I'm not writing in detail. Huh? I'm not writing in detail, brothers and sisters. So, here we have, brothers and sisters, exercise number 13. Huh? We have exercise number 13. Are you with me? Sug. Sug. What is the meaning of sug? Form. What is the verb? Write down there. Huh? What is the verb, sister? Manas? Saga. What is it? Saga. What kind of a bab it is? Sug tells you it is bab. Nasara. Saga Yasugu. Are you with me? Write down. Saga Yasugu. What is the Saga Yasugu, brother and sister? Na? To form. To form. F O R M. To form. Page, I have my old book, brother and sister. Exercise 13. 185. Exercise 13. Okay, new book, 56. Old book. Did you find it, sister Hafza? Is it 13? Exercise 13, sister Hafza? 13? Exercise is correct. Okay, brothers and sisters. Tasumu. Tasumu. Make Amar. Sumu. But if you have to make further uh, forms of Amar, then it will be Suma. With wow. And then Sumu. With wow. And then Anti. Sumi. With wow. Again Suma. And then Sumna. Okay. Okay. Takumu. What will be the Amar? Kum. And then Kuma. With wow. Kumu. Kumi, Kuma, Kumna. Okay. Takunu, what will be the Amar? Kun. Huh? Huh? If Allah decides to do something, all he has to say, Kun. Fayakun. Okay? Fine. So Kun. What will be for Huma? Kuna, with Wow. And then Kunu, it comes in the Quran. And then Kuni, it comes in the Quran, brother. And Kuna and Kunna. Fine, brother and sister. Zara. Yazuru, here is Tazuru. Amar, Zur. Zur. Huh? And then, Huma, Zura. Zuru, Zuri, Zura, Zurna. Very good. Tafa, Yatufu. Tuf. Tufa. I'm just giving you hints, brother. You know, Vav has to come after the first form. Taudu, Ud. Return. Uh, uda, Udu, fine. Tatubu, Tub. Uh, tub, and then Huma, 
Tuba and then Tubu with wow. Anti to be huh? with wow. Tuba and Tupna. This is a very nice one, but Zaka Yazuku. Huh? Taste. How do you say taste it? Look. Look who or look ha. Huh? Look. And then Zuka with wow. And then Antum Zuku. And then Zuki. Huh? Zuka and Zukana. Fine, brothers and sisters. <coughs> Brother Ba'a, what will be the Amar? Yabi'u, Tabi'u, Bi. The Ain Kalima got completely dropped. Huh? Okay, Nama Yanamu. Ya Nam. Huh? See? It's very easy for us to say Nim. No, it is Nam. Why Nam? Because it is Tanamu. Are you with me? If I write down Tanamu, I'm going a little fast, you know why? Because you are now very strong. We have been working on the verse for a long time. Tanamu. How do I make Amar? I give a Sukun here. I chop this off. Well, oh, there's a Sukun here also. So it goes out. What happens now? Nam. Nam. What will be for Jewel? Nama. Nama. Huh? Remember? Nama. Huh? Okay? The Aleph will remain. And will be for Antum? Namu. Are you with me? I'll write down quickly. Huh? Tana ma ni. Make Amar, brother. Noon will be dropped. This will be dropped. I don't have to drop anything more. So what is now? Nama. And if I say, if I say, Tana Muna. Huh? Are you with me? Tana Muna. How do I make Amar? Namu. Got the idea? Same will be if I say Bia. This is your Amar. And what will be for Huma? Bia. Huh? What it will be? Bia. What will be for Antum? B-U. Anti? B-E. You have to keep that in mind. But you got to practice this. Huh? As I said, at least, at least, minimum five conjugations from Bab Nasara, five conjugations from Bab Daraba, and two, two, you can do two. Please try to do it. Huh? As if you can't do too many, at least do by tomorrow at two, two. Huh? Two, two, inshallah. Okay, brothers and sisters. Now, now we are ready to go over to our main lesson now, inshallah. So far, interesting brothers and sisters. And you see, you can understand, you know, why are you understanding? Because alhamdulillah, you worked very hard. Huh? And this mutaharik pronoun does not gabrify us. We are not gabrified by mutaharik pronouns. Huh? We know it, huh? inshallah. Now brother, again the spelling rules for ja'a yaji'u. You know, Hamza has a spelling rule. So if I say, Ja'a, brothers and sisters, uh, Ya, Ji. Uh, remember, it is Jaya, uh, Ya, Ji, uh, Ya, Ji, then U will be written outside the Ya. Because you are pronouncing everything in the verb. Ya ji u. So everything is pronounced, so you will write down. Ha. But make it majizum. How will you write down? Ha. No, ya ji. Ya ji. So you will write down ya Now this is, ya has been dropped. Ha. Now what is this now? Kursi. For? Hamza. So you will now put it right inside it or at the corner of it. Okay? See here it is outside because you are pronouncing Yeah. Here your Yah has been dropped. 
So you have to write it on top of it or little inside. Huh? Because that is now kursi. Are you with me, Sister Fatima? If I say, if I say to you, Lum here, Lum here, what will happen, Sister Fatima here? I will give a sukoon. Sahi? Now there are two sukoons, so this gets dropped. Now there is a kasra before Hamza, G. So Hamza gets a kursi of Ya. So this is the kursi. Have other sisters? It is the kursi with Hamza sitting on it. Huh? But inside. Huh? Here the Hamza is outside. Keep that in mind. This is also explained in the in the lesson. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters. Al Mudarris. What is the meaning of Jaa? To come. Very important verb. Mata Jiata Min Juddata Ya Khalid. Translation, brother? When did you come from Jidda, O Khalid? Jietu Ansi. Jietu Ansi. Where is the verb, Sister Hamza? Je. Where is the verb? Jia. How will I describe it? Felun Madin Mabni Wala Sukun. When it is Mutaharik pronoun, then the Fel Madi will become Mabni Wala Sukun. When it is Sakin pronouns, then it will always be Mabni Wala Fata or in this case Dhamma. Dhamma. Huh? Okay, inshallah. Okay, so jiatu amsi. What is jiatu? Fail and file. Tu is the file. And what is amsi? Zarf. Zarfu? Zaman. Masha'Allah. Aja'a Ibrahimu ma'aka. Ja'a Ibrahimu ma'aka. Here is the verb. Ja'a. Fail umadin mabniun ala fatah. Ja'a. Fatah. Mabniun ala fatah. Okay, where is the file? Ibrahim. We cannot make mistakes. We have made lots of mistakes before. Uh, but not now. Now, alhamdulillah, we are alert. We are very careful. Huh? Okay, brother, look at it. Lam yaji baud. Huh? What is the meaning of it? Lam yaji. He did not come. Make into ma. What will you say? Ma. Ma ja. Ma sha Allah. Excellent, sister Afsa. Zadikillahu ilman. May Allah bless you in knowledge and all of us, inshallah. Ma ja. Are you with me? Or? Lam yaji. Both has same meaning. Huh? Ma ja'a or lam yaji. I am just trying to tell you, do not forget that we have, uh, uh, the meaning is same, but we can change the format of the verb. Ma ja'a or lam yaji. What is the meaning of ba'adu? Yet. Ba'adu means yet. Lam yaji ba'adu. He, it is zarf. Huh? Uh, he has not... Returned yet. Okay. Sayaji u. Now look at it. If you have highlighter, please highlight Yaji. So you know how the Hamza is written. Huh? And then you see Sayaji u, highlight that. And if you have different highlighter, use different highlighters. Are you with me, brother? And see how Yaji, Sayaji u is written. Al Yaum Aw Gadan, inshallah. Azurta Safira, Azurta Safira, where is the verb? Zor. What is the? File. And what is a Safira? Mafulun B. Did you visit the ambassador? Zahabtu ilal. Zahabtu ilal maktabihi. Walam ajidhu. Lam ajidhu. Wajada. 
e adido. E adido, tadido, tadido, adido, nadido, lam, adid. Inshallah. Samiatu. I heard Annahu that he is Lam Yakun. Fi Judda. I heard that he was not in Jeddah. Zakal Yauma. Okay, brother. Here is our nice treat. Zakal Yauma. Brother Abdul Samad, what is Zaka, brother? Zaka is. Uh, no. Susab, sir? Zarf, zarf. Susab, sir? Say loudly. <laughs> it is zarf, brother. Why it is zarf? Yeah. Yauma has come. So if Zaka. Yeah. Uh, what is Yauma? <laughs> Badal. See, our mind should think. Huh? It's very interesting, brother. This is the way we will study Quran also. Uh, inshallah. So, Zaka here means Zalika. Hmm? Now, this is, we will study this in book 3, brothers and sisters. Everything that we have studied, all the lessons will be repeated, but in much more detail. Uh, so, Zarf lesson consists of 10 to 12 pages. It is very interesting. In every way, we will, Dr. Abdurrahim will teach us how the Zarf works, you know. There is another name for zarf and that is maf'ulun fihi huh? that comes maf'ulun fihi maf'ulun fihi okay and that we will study in book 3 but you can say maf'ulun fihi zarf or zarf maf'ulun fihi for our you know simple way of understanding it's good enough inshallah once we learn then we can go in detail huh? okay brothers and sisters al mudarris Ya Adananu, innaka gipta. Okay, brother. What is gipta? What ghee tells you? Uh, no, it is ghaba. Uh, ghaba. And uh, what will be the mudarya? Ya ghibu. Ghaba, ya ghibu. Ya ghibu. And then ghaba, ghaba, ghabu, ghabat, ghabata, gibna. Gipta, Giptuma, okay. Innaka Gipta is Bu'aini. You remain absent two weeks. What is Bu'aini, brother? Zarf, mashallah. Uh, see, is Bu'aini, is Bu'aini. It's Mansub. Uh, it is Zarf, okay. For Aina Kunta, what is the, how you translate Aina Kunta? Where were you? Where were you? Uh, where? Were you? Aina kunta. Where were you? Okay. Kuntu fil mustashfa. Okay, brother. Kana yakunu. Kuntu. What is tu, brother? Is it a file? No. Ismu kana, brother. Kana. So many things to remember. Uh, brothers and sisters, if we keep on learning Arabic, we will never get sick with Alzheimer's disease. Because our mind is always, always active. You are thinking all the time. Arabic makes you think. Arabic makes you think all the time. Huh? Brothers and sisters. Okay, brother and sister. Where is the verb? Kun. How will I describe? Kun. Felu. Madin. Nakison. Mabniun ala. Sukun. What will be the two? Ismu kana. Huh? Ismu kana. Fine, brother, sister. Where is our khabar kana? If there is ism, there has to be khabar. Fil mustashfa. Jar majrur. Shibujmula. Khabar. But then, when we go in book three, we will go in further detail. Huh? Remember, there are still more details coming. Huh? But, brother Hassan, you, when I say details, they are all interesting things coming. You will love it, inshallah. Fine, brothers and sisters. Kuntu maridan. Now, this is very simple. Kuntu maridan. What is maridan? Why it is mansu? Khabar khana is always mansu. Uh, mashallah. Uh, oh, jitan. 
مفهول مطلق ہے دے از اے لٹل ایکسپلینیشن فار مفول المطلق کمنگ ان اے سینٹینس بٹ آئی ڈونٹ وانٹ ٹو گو ان ڈیٹیل ان شاء اللہ مفول المطلق ول ڈو ان بک تھری ان شاء اللہ واللہ واللہ وٹ از واللہ قسم وٹ از و قسم وٹ از اٹ بردر این وٹ از واو القسم واو القسم از اے پرپوزیشن حرف جر اس ام مجرور سو اللہ ہی ول بیکم مجرور بردر آئی ٹیل یو آنےسٹلی وین آئی وین آئی لرن آل دیز تھنگس اینڈ وین آئی واز ٹرائنگ ٹو ریڈ سلولی قرآن اینڈ ٹرائی ٹو انڈرسٹینڈ آئی واز so much surprise but pleasant huh? beautiful surprises with the things that person reads the Quran doesn't understand what is after wallahi lakad what is this lakad brother huh? what is this lakad the kad is for tahqiq huh? tahqiq and what is the la then Love will come for a jawabu qasam. Huh? Ji? No, 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 no. I said jawabu qasam. Are you with me? Jawabu qasam. Huh? Whenever there is a qasam, the jawab will start with la. Provided there is no nafi in the world. Huh? There is no nafi in the world. Brother, look at this, brother. Watini. What is Watini. Qasam, Allah is swearing. I swear by the fig. There is such deep meaning into all these things. Watini. Why it is majroor? Because vowel qasam is harfjar. Watini. Wazaitu ni. Waturi si ni na. Wahadhal bala dil ami ni. Qasra, why? Why? Wow, because everything is now mautu for Allah, huh? teeny. Okay, what is after that? Oh, why lakad? Jawabu kasam. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Jawabu kasam. La. There are two things in lakad. Kad comes for maadi. Kad comes for maadi. Kad comes for maadi. Huh? To emphasize. Okay, if there is a negation, then you don't use. Okay, but otherwise, you will use kath for maadi. Uh, okay, brothers and sisters, if I say, Aina hamidun, you can say, Zahaba, he went. But you, when you say, Kath Zahaba means he has gone. Uh, okay, now, what happens, brothers and sisters, when you read in the Quran, Lakad? لَقَدْ كَانَ لَكُمْ فِي رَسُولِ اللَّهِ اُسْوَةٌ حَسُنَةٌ So okay brother, what is لَقَدْ here? What is لَا? What is لَا? Where is the custom? مَحْزُوف Can you imagine? Allah is swearing. When you see لَقَدْ لَام is for the custom. As a jawab. Oh, where is the qasam? Mahzu, brother. Then when you read it, you have to understand it. Brothers and sisters, you have to understand it. So here is the ayah, brother. Lakad kana lakum fi rasulillahi uswatun hasanatun. Uswatun is your ismu kana. Are you with me? Ismu kana. Marfu. Okay, brothers and sisters. So you remember lakad now. Huh? This comes for a? Jawabu qasam. Laam is for jawabu qasam and kad for tahkik. Wallahi. He's swearing. Wallahi. Lakad kidtu amutu. How will you translate this, brother? I almost died. Huh? Huh? I almost died. 
Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So what is Kada? It is Mahdi. Huh? Kada, ya kadu. So Kada, Kada, Kadu, Kadat, Kadata, Kidna, Kidta, Lakad, Kidtu, Amu, Tu, Mata, Yamutu. Now remember, Kada, ya kadu, Kada is also a weak uh, verb. So it will have ism. So where is the ism of kidtu? Tu. Uh, where is the ism? In kidtu, where is the ism? Tu. Where is the khabar? Uh, what is amotu? Fail, mudharia, mafun bi dhamma. Where is the file? Where is the file? Mustatir, takdiruhu? Ana. Are you with me? Takdiru ana. So what will you say? Jumla failure coming as a khabar far kaada. Wallahi lam arif zalika. Wallahi. But the lakad did not come. Because it is lam, negation. When the negation came, there was, you cannot use. You have ma, I have lam. I have your lam. Wallahi lam arif zalika. Fine. Hey, what is the difference between? If I say lan arif and you say, <laughs> I have it here, you can check my book afterwards, brother. Uh, when I was studying, uh, uh, I had this book, which is a photocopy from my ustad, you know. So, I have Arif. But because Ma came, Ma Araftu, you cannot put Lakad here. Okay, brothers and sisters? What is Zalika? Mafulun bihi. Mafulun bihi, brother. Lam yakul li ahdun. Lam yakul li ahdun. Brother, how will you translate? No one told me. Where is the file of yakul ahdun? Innaka. Brother, it is innaka and not annaka. Why innaka? Because kala has come. Innaka maridun wa innaka fil mustashfa. Okay, brothers and sisters. Kaifa haluka al-ana lalaka lalaka al-ana ahsanu. How will you say? Translate, brothers and sisters. How are you now? Hopefully, you are better. Alhamdulillah. أنا الآن أحسن. I'm better now. ولكنني لكن proper لكن and then ني اسمه لكن منصوب لا أزال لا أزال. What is أزال؟ ناقص verb. Where is the اسم of أزال؟ مستتر تقديره and ha, where is the khabar of azalu? Daifan, mansu. Masha'Allah. Okay, then what is la azalu, daifan doing here? Sister Rahima, what is la azalu doing here? Khabar for? Masha'Allah. It's a khabar for lakina. Jumla failia coming as a khabar for lakina. See, all these things we have to think. Let me tell you one more thing, brothers and sisters. Some of you are very quick, and some of you are not. And those of you who are not, uh, please don't despair. And don't blame yourself. I always say, it's very easy for us to say, Main Buddha ho gaya hu. Ya, you will say, Main abhi buddhi ho gaya hu. No, brother, age is not the barrier. Huh? Some people get quickly. Others get slowly. What about me? Brother, I got it very slowly. But I did not look to anybody on my left and right that they were doing fast. I just said, okay, I will do on my own 
pace and at my own speed. And if you put your effort uh, consistently, I assure you, all of you, each and every one of you will become strong. It will take little time, but you will become strong, inshallah. And do you want any proof? There are proofs in the class. I don't want to take names because I'll embarrass them. Uh, they are the people who did not understand much in the beginning. But then they went on putting their effort. And brother and sister, I'm surprised at their progress. I'm surprised and extremely happy at their progress. Because they just went on working, 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 and they got it. So don't, you know, despair. If you cannot get it fast. If you understand, alhamdulillah. And then you have to practice. Huh? Okay, inshallah. Man jadda wajada. Man zara'a hasada. One who, one who sows will reap, inshallah. And in English, what should we say? No pain, no gain. Simple. No pain, no gain. Fine, brothers and sisters. Shafaqallahu shifa'an kamilan. Huh? Brothers and sisters, huh? what is mafulun mutlaq? Mafulun mutlaq is the master of the verb which is used in the sentence. And it is used to emphasize it. Are you with me? This is the simplest of explanation. What is mafulun mutlaq? Mafulun mutlaq is the master. Master of what? Of the verb which you are using in the sentence. Why are you using it? For emphasis. For emphasis. So here is the most beautiful example. Shafaqallahu. Where is the verb? Shafa. What is mudari of shafa? Yashfi. Shafa, yashfi. Okay, brother. Shafa. What is ka? Mafulun bi. Where is the file of shafa? Allahu. So here you have fi'al, mafulun bihi, and file. And what is shifa'an? Mafulun. What is shifa'an? It's a master. From shafa yashvi. So you use master. Okay? To for emphasis. And what is kamilan? Naak for what? Shifa. That's all. So if, if all the time you say shukran, what is shukran, brother? Ana ashkurka shukran. So because the verb is there, shakara yashkuru, you can use shukran. Mafulun mutlaq, for the, it is a master from the verb which is used, but here you did not use it. Huh? Okay, brothers and sisters. Mafulun mutlaq comes a lot in the Quran, in a most beautiful way, most beautiful way. Mudar is directing his attention to Uthman. Ya Uthman, innaka taghibu kathiran. What is the meaning of this? You are remaining absent. What is kathiran, brother? Baful and mutlaq. Innaka taghibu. What is the master from Ghaba Yaghibu? Giyabun. 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 Huh? So, what is actually? Innaka. Innaka taghibu giyabun kathiran. So, sometimes you will not have uh, the master mentioned. And nat is mentioned, which is kathiran for. Huh? And that will take the place of mafulun mutla. Huh? Okay? Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Gipta yaumaini. في هذا الأسبوع وثلاثة أيام في أسبوع المادي. Brother, gibta. Where is the fiel? Gib. Huh? And what is the file? Uh, yawmaini. What is yawmaini? Zarf. Zarf. Mansub. Zarf. Huh? Okay. في harf char. What is haza? Isam majur. And what is usbu? Uh, badal, mashallah, badal. Okay, what is salasata? What is salasata? Why is salasata? Yawmaini, mashallah. So what will you call salasata, badal, uh, Abdul Samad? Badal? No, no. Zarf, zarf, zarf. 
Huh? See, actual zarf is ayamin. Huh? But salasata, now it is naib. Huh? All these things are coming in book three. Huh? But I just want to point out to you, the salasata, you saw ta, it is not mafulun bihi, but it is zarf. And it is mautufun ala yomain. Yomain. Huh? The actual zarf became mudafilihi. Fi ismul ma'adi. La yan baghi li talibin an yaghiba kathiran. Again kathiran came. Brother, here it is. Yan baghi. What kind of a verb is this? Now this is definitely not a three letter verb. What is this verb? In bagha. What is it? In bagha. I will write down brother. You don't have to worry huh? In bagha. What will be the mudarya? Yan ba gi. Brothers and sisters, in this verb, we, it is called form 7. In this, brother, you are adding, what are you adding? In. What did you add? In. You add in to the three letter verb. So what is the root of here? Bagaya. Huh? Bagaya. Huh? In Baga. Huh? And then Mudarya is Yan Baghi. Okay, fine. Brothers and sisters, what is the meaning of Yan Baghi? Or in Baga? Huh? To be appropriate, to be desirable, brothers and sisters, proper. Huh? So when you say La Yan Baghi, it is not proper, it is not desirable, huh? it is. Okay, what is the another word for in Baga? Write it down, brother and sister. Wajaba. Wajaba Yajibu. Huh? Huh? Okay. Remember what happens in Yajibu? How we get the file for Yajibu? Who remembers? Masdar Mu'awwal, mashallah. Zadik Allahu ilman ya Sukhaina. May Allah increase you in knowledge and all of us. Huh? We have to remember, huh? Yajibu alayka. Now here's a nice sentence. Yajibu alayna an nadrusa lugatal arbiya. Li annaha lugatun Quran. It is wajib on us to study the language, Arabic language. Because it is the language of the Quran. Na? Okay? Yeah, again another verb, brother. Yajibu alayna an nafhama al Quran. Wa naamal bihi. It is wajib of us to understand Quran and act by it. Na? Okay, according to it. Okay, so brother and sister, I gave you the hint. Where is the file for Yanbagi? Masdar Mu'awwal. Huh? Underline it, highlight it, brother. Where is the file, brother? An Yaghiba. An Yaghiba is your Al Master Al Mu'awwal. Fi Mahali Rafa'in file for Yanbagi. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? La Yanbagi li Talibin. It is not appropriate for a student huh, to remain absent. So much, a lot, huh? Okay. Brother, what is the reply? Very smart fellow, huh? What did he say? La maghib. What is the meaning of la maghib? Uh, changes into ma. Ma giptu. Ma giptu. What will you say? Ma giptu. Huh? Lam aghib salasata ayamin. What is salasata here? Zarf. What is it? Zarf. Salasata ya fisbul maadi. Kama kulta. What is the meaning of kama kulta? As you said. Huh? Innama. Innama is the most beautiful word, brother. But we, I don't want to go in detail. It is so beautiful. It has got such a fantastic, you know, depth in it. Inshallah, when we go to uh, book three, we will learn. Remember. Kul. Innama ana basharun mithlukum. 
So what is this in Nama doing here? Of course we see in Prasma, but we are going to learn in book 3 the details about it. Simple translation, what is the simple translation? Only. But that only does not justify it. Only does not justify in Nama. In Nama, brothers and sisters, Giptu Yauman, see, Yauman, in Nama Giptu Yauman, Wahidan Fakat. Okay. I only remain absent one. You say I remain absent three days. Huh? What is the Buddha is saying? La tagzib. Huh? Don't lie, ya huh? Don't be smart. Huh? La tagzib. Huh? What is the word, brother? Kazaba yak zibu. To to tell a lie. Huh? La. Inna ka ghipta. So, brother, Gipta is Khabar Inna. Huh? Ka? Okay. Yawma Sapti wa Yawma Salasai wa Yawma Arbiai. No, he's caught, you know. Ana Asifun, ya Ustad. I'm sorry. Lan Aghiba. I will not remain absent. Fil Mustakbal. Inshallah. Okay, brother and sisters. Kum. Amar has come now. Kum. Get up. Huh? Kum, get up. Stand up. Huh? Ya ada mum. Okay, what is kum? How do I analyze kum? Felu amren mabni ala sukum. Aina fail mostate. Takdiruhu anta. Mashallah. Kum ya adam. Atanamu fil fasli. You are sleeping in the class. Atanamu fil fasli. Tanamu. Felun mudariun marfun bi damma. Fail mustatir. Takdiruhu anta. Fine, brother. Ana asifun ya ustad. Ghalabani annaumu. It's not my fault. <laughs> I'm innocent. Huh? Huh? The sleep overpowered me. Are you with me? The sleep overpowered me. That's why I slept. Huh? Ghalaba. Huh? This is your fail mahdi. What is noon doing here? Nunu Vikaya. What is Yam Mutakalim? Mafulun Bihi. And where is the file? Annaumu. See? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Huh? Fine. Li Annani because Ma Nim to Al Barihab. Al Barihab means last night. Huh? Ma, this is Zarf. Ma Nim to Al Barihab. Okay? I. How will you translate? I did not. Change ma nim to lam anam. Lam anam. No, anam sounds very exotic. But you know it is nam yanamu. Are you with me? Yanamu, tanamu, tanamu, anamu, nanamu. So you put yanamu and put lam, it will become yanam. Huh? It will become Yanama. Let me write down, brothers and sisters. Anamu. Okay, and I put here Lam. Okay, I have to give Sukun here. There is a Sukun already here. So this will get chopped off. What is, what is left? Anam. Huh? See how we got it? Now, how will you learn all these things? You will learn by conjugating them. And the sheet, now you will conjugate fully. Huh? There is a column for lam, there is a column for lan. You should conjugate fully. Leave the majhul form. Don't, don't do that, you know. There, is a, there are two columns that you should not attempt. One is the nunu thakila. Don't attempt that. Huh? We'll do it in book three. And the other column is majhul. And the last two columns, leave it aside. Huh? Don't, don't bother. Do, Madi, Modaria, Amar, La Nahia, Lan, and Lam. That's all. These, are, these columns are in the beginning. Okay. So, Ma Nim Tu Al Bariha. Now, see how the question is asking. How beautifully the Ustad is asking. Lima Lam Tanam. See? Tanam. Tanamu became Tanam. Lam Tanam. Translation. Why didn't you sleep? 
change lang talam into madi lima uh, lima ma nimta lima ma nimta why didn't you sleep okay very beautiful sentence requires your full attention kana bi very beautiful sentence requires your full attention kana bi kana bi sudaun shadidun kana fa'lu madin naqisun mabni ala fata where is the ism of kana where is the ism of kana ism kana marfu sudaun hede sudaun marfu sudaun is the ismu kana and what is shadidun Not, not. Oh, where is the khabar kana? B. B. How many letters are there? How many words are there? Two. Ya mutakalim. So what will you call it? Jar majru. Shibu jumla. That is the khabar kana. I had a severe headache. This is how will you translate? I had a severe headache. And fa. Therefore, fa. Lam anam. See, lam anam. Or you can say. Therefore, uh, ma nimtu, nimtu, nimtu. Uh, lam anam bi sababihi, bi sababi. Oh, everybody knows sabab, uh, so commonly used in Urdu, but it is Arabic. Bi harf jar sababi isam majrur wa huwa mudaf. He mudaf ilahi. Masha Allah, Masha. Yarinul jarasu. Ha? Yarinu jarasu, ranna yarinu, ha? ranna yarinu, yarinu jarasu, fayakumu, fayakumu mudarisu, and the mudaris stands up. Okay, Saeed, ya Ustad, ana uridu an azuraka, ana uridu an <coughs> azuraka. Al yawma ba'd salat al asri. Translation, brother. Huh? See now you can easily see how we say in English to, and in Arabic we say an. Are you with me? Al mudaris zorni gadan. Zorni visit me tomorrow. Zor. What is zor? Fi amrin mabniun ala sukun. Fail mustati takdiruhu. Anta, what is ni doing here? Nunu ikaya, and then ya mutakalim ba fulun bihi. And what is gadan doing here? Zar, zarfu zaman. Fa means here because. Fa means because. Fa inni mashgulun al yom. Fa inni, what is inna? Harfu taukid wa nasbin. What is ya? Ismu inna. Mansub and what is mashgulun? Khabarin and what is al yawma? Zarf, mashallah, mashallah, mashallah. I think, inshallah, we'll take a, a short break, I have some tea and some snacks, brother, and we'll carry on, inshallah. Brother Ajib Anil Asilati Al Atiyati, Kam Usbu An Ghaba Adnanu. How many weeks did Adnan remain absent? What will you say? Very simple. Gaba usbuaini. Gaba usbuaini. Very simple, brother. Lima kana Adnan gaiban. Why was Lima kana Adnan gaiban? How will you translate? Why was Adnan absent? Li annahu kana maridan. Because he was sick. Li annahu kana. Marida, na? because he was sick. Okay, fine. Kam yawman gaba uthmanu filisbo aini. Brother and sister, what will you say? Gaba, then you count it. Khamsata ayamin. Total, huh? brother and sisters. Lima lam yanam adamu. Lima lam yanam adamu. How will you translate? Why he did not sleep? Okay, what is the answer? Kana bihi sudaun 
shadidun. Huh? Inshallah. You'll be able to write it. Do write it, brother. Inshallah. Fine. Now, we already done this, brother. Uh, okay. I, I think I'm going to do a little quick thing here, brother and sisters. I'll be very quick with you. We know we can conjugate kala. We'll do one more time. Ready? Quickly. Kala, kala, kalu, kalat, kalata, kulna, kulta, kultuma, kultum, kulti, kultuma, kultunna, kultu, kulna. Hamidun, kala. Aminatu, kalat. Atulabu, kalu. Atalibatu, kulna. Atalibatu, kulna. Anta, kulta. Anti, kulti. Antum, antunna, ana, nahnu. Come on, give me a break. Alhamdulillah, we know it. Huh? Easy brothers and sisters, won't be difficult. Ready? Now, number four says that you should do the same with Kama, Zara and Kana. Ready? Brother? Uh, Kama, Kama, Kamu, Kamat, Kamata, Kumna, Kumta, Kumtuma, Kumtum, Kunti, Kuntuma, Kuntunna, Kumtu, Kumna. Okay? Muhammadun, Kama, Khadijatu, Kamat, huh? At-tullabu kamu. At-talibatu kumna. Ana kumtu. Anta kumta. Anti kumti. Nahnu kumna. Antum kumtum. Antunna kuntunna. Very good brother. Zara, ready? Zara. Zara, zaru, zarat, zarata. Zurna, Zurta, Zurtuma, Zurtum, Zurti, Zurtuma, Zurtunna, Zurtu, Zurna. Now tell me why did you say Zur? The, your answer should be Motaharik pronoun came in the verb. Huh? Remember that. Huh? Sakin pronouns and Motaharik. How many Sakin pronouns in Madi? Five. How many Motaharik pronouns in Madi? Nine. The changes. The take place at mutaharik pronoun. This is what now we should understand. Huh? Okay, uh, that agreement was signed. Those are all obsolete now. <laughs> we don't have to say that. Huh? Kana, ready? Kana, kana, kanu, kanat, kanata, kunna, kunta, kuntuma, kuntum, kunti, kuntuma, kuntunna, kuntu, kunna. Huh? Hamidun, kana. Aminatu kanat. Attullabu kanu. Attalibatu kunna. Ana kuntu. Anta kunta. Nahnu kunna. Anti kunti. Antum kuntum. Antunna kuntumna. Inshallah you will understand. Eh? Now brothers and sisters, we have sentence. We will read it. Eh? And you will, wherever necessary you can highlight it. Zurna al mudarrisa jadida al barihata. Translation, brothers. Zurna, we visited the new teacher last night. Are you with me? Where is the fiel, brother? Zur. Holy Zur, brother. I say fiel, Zur. Fellow madin mabniun ala sukun. Only sukun, brother. Where is the file? Na, Masha. And Mudaris is Mafulun be. And then Naat. And then Zarf. Very good, brother. Now you are asking your sister. She is making a biryani now for you. Okay? Azukti hada taama ya ukhti. Translation? Did you taste this food? Oh, my sister. Okay. Zukti. Fiel. Madin. Mabniun Allah. Sukun. Where is the file? T. T is the file, anti, huh? T is the file. Haza, what is haza? Mafulun bihi, what is it? Ama, badal, brother. Fine, brother. And what will you say? Ya, harfunida. And what will you say? Ukhti, it is mudaf, mudafili. Harfunida and munada, wa huwa mudaf. And ya mutakalim mudafili. Very good, brother. What is the answer? Naam, what is Naam? Harfu Jawab. What is it? Harfu Jawab. 
Zuk to hu. Zuk to and hu. Three things. Zuk to hu. Five. Mafulun. Zuk to hu. Wa wajad. Wajad to hu. Are you with me? Wajad to. I found it. How did you find it? Delicious. Huh? And what is jiddan? Mafulun mutla. Mafulun mutla. Zahabtu ilal Makkah. I went to Makkah. Wa tuftu. Taafa yatufu. Tuftu bil Kaaba. Translation, brother? Makkah. And did tawaf around the Kaaba. MashaAllah. Sumna yomal isnaini. Brother, sumna. We fasted. Sum and na. What is yawma? Zarf, mashallah. Very good. Zarf, mudaf, mudaf ilahi. Maza kultali hamidin ya Ahmad. Translation. What did you say to Hamid ya Ahmad? Huh? What is the answer? Ma kultalahu shayyan. Ma. What is the translation? I didn't say anything. Huh? Very good, brother. You know, huh? Shayan is mafulun bihi. Huh? Fine. Mata kumtum minan naumi ya binai. Kumtum. Kum fiel tum file. Minan naumi ya binai. Kumna. We got up. Kabla. Azan il fajr. We got up before the Adhan of the fajr. Oh, 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 this is not a nice sentence. You have experienced this a lot, brother. Baal tiflu fi thawbi. You're on my shirt, brother. You see a beautiful child, you want to take him and hug him and give a kiss, and he says thank you to you by wetting your shirt. <laughs> Are you with me? <laughs> we have experienced this a lot. Huh? Okay, fine. No problem, brother. Where is the file? Tiflu. Very good. Fine. Tubtu ilallahi. Tubtu. I repented. Repented to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. I repented. Kuntu muta'abban. Translation, brother. I was exhausted, tired. Ayawma. Today. Falam azhab ilal madrasati. Lam azhab. Ma zahab tu. Go to the school. Zarani sadiqi. This is important, brother and sister. Zarani sadiqi. Fine, brother. Very beautiful. Zara. Where is the verb? Zara. Fielu. Madin mabniun ala fata. And what is ni? Nunu vikaya. Nunu vikaya. And then ya mutakalim? Mafulun bihi. Where is the file? Sadiqu. Wa huwa mudafin ya mutakalim. Brother. Wa zurtuhu. Yesterday he visited me and today was Zur to who? Al Yawma. Zur to who? Fiel. Fine. Mafurum bi. Got the idea? Alhamdulillah. Okay, brother. Now we come to Mudaria. Now, inshallah, we know all these things. Hamidun Yakulu. Ready? We'll do the whole thing, brother. Yakulu. Yakulani. Yakuluna. Takulu. Takulani. Yakulna. Takulu. Takulani. Takuluna, takulina, takulani, takulna, akulu, nakulu. Mashallah. Any difficulty, brother? Hamidun, yakulu. Aminatu, takulu. Are you with me? Atullabu, yakuluna. Atalibatu, yakulna. Ana, akulu. Nahnu, nakulu. Anta, takulu. Are you with me, brother? Sister? Antum, takuluna. Antunna, takulna. Takulna. Are you with me? This is very easy, brothers and sisters. We can do one more, brother. Kama yakumu. Ready? Yakumu. Yakumani. Yakumuna. Takumu. Takumani. Yakumna. Takumu. Takumani. Takumuna. Takumina. Takumani. Takumna. Akumu. Nakumu. Same will happen with Tafa. Yatufu. Yatufani. Yatufuna. Tatufu. Tatufani. Yatufna, tatufu, tatufani, tatufuna, tatufina, tatufani, tatufna, atufu, natifu. 
انا ازوروکا و انت لا تزورونی what is this brother translation I visit you and you don't visit me you don't visit me brother انا what is انا مبتدا where is our خبر ازورو what is ازورو ازورو دیزو مدافع مدافع لی ازورو فعلون مداریون مرفون بی تمام where is the file مستطیر تقدیرو انا and what is کا مفهوم بی and then wow اتاف and then انتا مبتدا and where is the خبر لا تزورونی تزورو فعلون مداریون مرفون بی تمام فایل مستطیر تقدیرو انتا انا نون نونو وکایا ان یا مفعول بہی انشاءاللہ تطوفو حجاج بالکعبہ ترانسلیشن بردر یطوفو یطوفو الحجاج بالکعبہ آری ویتلی پرلگرمز آر گوئنگ اراؤن دا کعبہ میکنگ دا تواف آر You say to your mother, Maza takulina yaumi. Translation? What are you saying? What are you saying? Maza takulina. What is takulina, brothers and sisters? Felon, mudarion, marfon, bi. Subutinon. Where is the file? Yeah. Very good, brothers and sisters. Uriduan akuna mudarisan. Translation, brother. I want to be. A teacher, brother. Fine, brother. Where is the Uridu needs mafulun bihi? Where is mafulun bihi? Al master al muawwal. Okay, fine. Where is the ism of kana? Akunu. Here it is akuna. Felun mudarion mansubun bilfata. Ism musatir takdiruhu ana. And what is mudarisan? Khabar. Khabar kana. Al banatu. Yazurna khalata hunna kulla usbu'in. Okay, brother. Albanatu. What is albanatu? Mubtada. Where is the khabar? Yazurna. Now let us do this properly. Yazurna. Fialun. Mudariun. Mabniun. Ala sukun. Fi mahalli rafa'in. Because there is nothing there. Fi mahalli rafa'in. And where is the file? Nunu niswa. Are you seeing? No, you don't have to say mutarik. Mutarik is for our understanding. Are you with me? Mutarik is, if you want to write down in detail, you can, but it is not necessary. The most important thing, sister Manas, is we understand that the file in uh, the Madi and Mudariya are divided into two groups, Sakin and Mutarik. When the Mutarik uh, pronouns come as a file, what happens? Lam Kalima gets a Sukun. And plus, if they are weak letters, then in Ajwaf, changes take place in Mahdi. And you will see same things happening in Nakis, but in a different way. In a different way. But Nakis, you know, first day you will feel, oh, that's too much. But I assure you, you are going to fall in love with Nakis verbs. They are very beautiful. You will like it, brother. And you see, the most beautiful thing is, brothers and sisters, this knowledge will enable you to open the Quran and understand what's going on in the sentence. Inshallah. A lot. Sister Mamuna, you have a question, sister? Which one, sister? Yazurna? Okay. She, Yazurna. Okay. Fialun. Madharion. Mabniyun ala sukun. Now I have to decide if it is mabni, is it marfu? Is it mansu? And in the case of verb, is it majizum? Do you see anything that will make the fail mudariya mansu or majizum? No. So it is then marfu. Fi mahalli rafa'in. And where is the file? Noon. And where is mafulun bihi? Khalata. Wa huwa mudaf. And hunna mudahbe. What is kulla? Zarf. Kulla is zarf. We will later on learn 
it, it is naibun al later on in book 3. Uh, it is deputizing the zarf. The zarf is a spoon. Seven days. Uh, that is the actual zarf. Uh, but Kulla came ahead of it and took the fatah. Uh, zarfs are all mansub most of the time. So he took the fatah from usbu and made the usbu into mudafilehi. Uh, it made into mudafilehi. Kulla usbu in kulla yawmin, kulla amin. What does it mean? Every year, every week, every month. Kulla shahirin, inshallah. Qala tullabu li mudarrisihim. Ya ustad, the students tell, told the teacher, Ya ustad, nahnu nuridu an nadhu raka. Nadhu raka. Ghadan. We want to visit you tomorrow. Okay, very good brother. Okay, here we have majzoom form, brother. Tamal mayali yakulu lam yakul. Are you with me? Iltikai sakinaini. So we have to drop the weak letter. Adhil lam ala lafali laatiyati. And then but put the proper vowel signs, brother. Put the proper vowel signs. Yakunu, put lam, yam yakun. Yakumu, lam yakum. Yabulu, lam yabul. Yaduru, yasumu. Yatubu, lam yatubu. Okay, brothers and sisters. Ajib anil as'ilatil atiyati bin nafi. Negate it. Mustamilan using lam. You just have to negate it, brother. We will, inshallah, try to do this. Azzurta al mudira ya ali. La. You will say la. Lam. Azur. You can say who. Lam azur who. I did not visit him. Lam azur who. Okay, brothers and sisters. Akama akhuka min naomi. Now, akhu is your file for akama. Uh, remember, what is the meaning of this? Akama ahuka mina nomi. Did your brother get up from his sleep? Huh? So, what is the answer? La. Lam. It is for him. Yakum. Huh? Lam yakum baadu. Not yet. What will you say? Yakum baadu. Remember baadu? Huh? Let me write down, brother. Lam Yakum Badu. What is the meaning of Badu? Yet. Okay, brother and sister. Abal Teflu Fi Kamisika. Did the child wet your shirt? What will you say? La Lam. La lam yabul fihi in it. Huh? La lam yabul fihi. Lam fihi. Inshallah. Next one, brothers and sisters. Ya Aisha. Asumti amsi. Translation, brother. Did you fast yesterday? And what will she, she say? La. Lam asum. That's all. Lam asum. That's all. Brothers and sisters, you will write down. Huh? This is the most important exercise to write down. Okay? This one particularly. Huh? Very important. Write down everything. Akunta fil fasli fi hissatil ula. Translation. Were you in the class in the first period? What will you say? La lam akun. La lam akun fihi. Huh? Okay. Or lam akun fil fasli you can say. Okay. Azukti hazatama ya ummi. Did you taste this biryani ya ummi? 
la lam azuk azuk hu i did not taste it lam azuk hu ha inshallah aqulta hakaza ya umar did you say like this ya umar what will you, what the umar will say la ha lam aqul la lam aqul hakaza you can say la lam aqul hakaza i didn't say like that huh? okay brothers and sisters aada what is the meaning of aada raja aada means raja aada mudariya yaudu huh? aada yaudu aada yaudu aada means raja aada akhuka min ar-riyad ya salma what will you say la la lam yaud atufta bil kaaba ya akhi did you do the tawaf what will you say la lam atuf are you comfortable brother these inshallah should not be difficult because you have worked very hard with the verbs huh? and if you will practice tonight huh, this evening tasabi huh, at least a uh, few of each section you conjugate you will become strong inshallah akunta maridan fi al-usbu' al-madi translation brother were you sick last week what will you say la lam akun maridan i wasn't sick lam akun maridan or will you say ma kuntu lam akun or ma kuntu maridan fine brothers and sisters oh ho 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 amata kalbu no you see mata verb mata has can come as a mata yamutu which is bab nasara and then it can come as a mata yamatu both will come in the quran dr saheb is explaining in the key okay now look at it me balan sir mata bab nasara mata mata matu matat matata mutna mutna ha huh? now that is bab nasara make it into bab samia mata mata matu matat matata mitna both of them in both forms are in the quran ha huh? but when it comes to mudhariya only bab nasara has come see remember quran <laughs> dictates the arabic grammar brother ha huh? the, the the arabic grammar is derived from the quran the more you think and ponder about quran the more you find that it is the most miraculous book brother it is the greatest miracle of allah subhanahu wa taala and and the miracle lies in the way the message was conveyed huh? nobody can produce anything like quran now if you take a passage from bible and you try to use the quranic language and you say here i produce brother you only copied it produce something different which is as good and eloquent as the quran don't copy the quran and say i copied it i made a surah or i made a verse no then you only copied the style create something of your own which is as eloquent and as beautiful as quran nobody has done nobody has produced anything which is equivalent to quran it in its eloquence and beauty Okay, brothers and sisters. So here we are, amata kalbu. So in mudaria, you will only go to mata yamutu. Huh? What will you say? La, lam, yamut. Correct. Yes, I told you, brothers and sisters, that it is in the mudaria, mata yamutu, bab nasara. In madi, in the Quran, you will find bab nasara. as well as bab samia no yamut no who you cannot say if a person dies he dies brother so there is no wafur on be are you with me there is no wafur on be okay brother and sisters now the next one is amal there is still lot to do but because now it is more or less same repetition inshallah tomorrow in the first half an hour 
we will try to uh, try to finish. Then I'll tell you a few more things, and then we'll try to understand Narkis, and we will do it slowly, slowly, so that you have a clear-cut idea, brothers and sisters. I'll be a very happy person if I hear from you that yes, we understand the Ajwaf and Nakis and Mudaf well, inshallah. Huh? Because this is what we are aiming, that you should have a complete knowledge of these verbs. And remember, before we go to book three, we will again learn the ten forms of verb. And you will find amazing these things. Huh? Inshallah. So that when we are in book three, any time a verb comes, we'll stop. And we'll say, what is this going on? What form is this? This will make you so strong that when you come to the study of Quran, Inshallah, Inshallah, you will understand everything. ربنا آتنا في الدنيا حسنة وفي الآخرة حسنة وكنا عذاب النار ربنا ظلمنا أنفسنا إن لم تغفر لنا وترحمنا لا نكونن من الخاسرين ربنا هب لنا من أزواجنا وزرياتنا قرة أيون وجعلنا للمتقين إماما ربنا تقبل منا إنك أنت سميع العليم وتب علينا إنك أنت تواب رحيم سبحان ربك رب العزة أما يسفون وسلام على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين